Sammy the hippo loved his mud pool. He liked getting muddy. He thought it was cool. He'd dive in from high, his feet over his head, and make a big splash, which his mom learned to dread. He'd rub mud and smear it between all his toes. It's amazing the places a hippo's mud goes. But what he liked best was to stick his head under and make a rude noise with bubbles like thunder. His mommy would watch him. She wasn't so keen, for she liked to keep things all tidy and clean. Her house was kept pretty, all flowers and lace. She never stopped dusting. Things were kept in their place. Well, you can imagine her utter dismay at the dreadful result of Sam's muddy display. He'd left dirty footprints on her shiny clean floor and big hippo handprints on the walls and the door. His mommy got cross and made her feelings quite clear. As she told her young son, don't bring mud into here. Poor Sammy was sorry, but what could he do? He loved mud so much, but he loved his mom too. After a bath, Sam sat on mom's knee. Please try, said his mom, to stay clean like me. She gave him a hug. Then Sam said he would try. Even though mud was best, he'd try to stay dry. Through the door the next morning came an invite to play. From Molly the monkey to her house the next day. Her birthday party was the talk of the town. There'd be bouncy castles and a big smiley clown. Oh, please, can I go? Said Sammy, excited. His mommy said, Yes, we've both been invited. Hooray! cried out Sam. What shall I wear? He chose his red shoes, and Mom combed his hair. And what a great party it turned out to be. Molly's garden was full. There was so much to see. There were games to play and rides to ride. And loads of food to shovel inside. They both had such fun. And to Sammy's surprise, he came first in the sack race and was given a prize. All of the grown-ups were allowed just one race, and Sammy cheered loudly as his mom made first place. So they both won a present. And Sam's was a gnome. But mom kept hers wrapped until they got home. Mom sat by the pool. Sam sat on her knee. Mom unwrapped the present. What could it be? Well, the prize she had got for winning her race was some kind of makeup to put on your face. The label made clear that Beauty Sublime would give you great skin in next to no time. They couldn't believe it, for the present she'd got was a beauty mud pack in a big mud pack pot. They both fell back laughing. Mud for his mommy? Then Sam laughed again. It was ever so funny. She was really delighted and had to agree. Perhaps mud is good for you and for me. Now both enjoy mud for beauty and play. But both wash it off at the end of the day.